Hello guys and welcome back to my channel Powell again. Today we are going to see different blades uh, in a checkpoint firewall R81.10. So when you come to the manage and settings, if you see here there is blade settings. There are three blades which you can configure from the old sort of configuration, uh, the old dashboard. If you click these settings, you will go diverted to this old dashboard. For example, let me click to the HTTPS inspection. It will take me to the old dashboard. <clears throat> and over here, you have an option to configure mobile access, uh, uh, your anti-spam, DLP, so on. So, uh, in the comment, I have received uh, questions like how to configure HTTP inspection with R81.10, how to configure mobile access. So let's see uh, what new here. So when you come to the HTTP inspection, uh, you will see all the all options here. Uh, this is uh, the R77 and. Uh, I mean, uh, the four sort of things. <laughs> so this is uh, my all uh, AD configuration. <clears throat> so you can see things from here. Uh, this is how you can see everything, menu bar. Let me go ahead and stop that. So when you come to here, HTTP inspection, you have different options: gateway, trusted CA, uh, then HTTPS validation, server certificates, uh, no outbound CA certificate for HTTP inspection was created. That is fine. So right now what we are going to do, we are going to create one certificate and we will give that certificate to uh, this uh, my server. So as of now if you see, I am getting a certificate warning all the time. So if I don't want that, I have to give the certificate. You see, there's no certificate here. Uh, let me go back here. So this is all the trusted certificates so far. It's built in. We don't have any certificate created as of now with the gateway. So let's go back here and say create a new certificate issue name dn let's give it a company name for example www.firewallgan.com private key retype the private key uh well it is okay and in a go the certificate will create so your management server will act like your you know trusted ca and from here you can export the certificate uh, let's keep it on license desktop say cert 101 for example, you can name and you can import that certificate to your this thing, but I don't know if I can copy paste that certificate here. But let's see if we can do that. Uh, there's something for license 
time. And if you see the certificate is created here, copy and want to paste it to the server, but I don't see that option here. Mm. If I can enable the RDP, let me see if I can. Mm, show on desktop map. Remote setting. <coughs> Allow connection from the remote. Hello. That is fine. Let's do RDP to this server <coughs> and from there if we can copy paste the certificate. Let's see. 192, 168, 1 This is the choices what they have. Let's see if I can do like this for again. Uh, test for now. Give the password. So I can able to log in. Let me see if I can test my certificate. Hope so I can test it now. So we can install the certificate in this way also. Let me try now. <coughs> Checkpoint.com. So as you can see the certificate is already installed, I can see here, and this is a certificate, I don't know still we are to, uh, why we are getting the error. So the certificate is there, but still I am not giving, getting, this thing is not really low. 